Hi, I'm James, and today on Wonder Zoom with Cincinnati Museum Center, we are going to make this fly like this. Now, for today's experiment, we're going to need some construction paper, a straw, a nice thick drinking straw, a ruler, pencil, scissors, and tape. What we're going to do is we're going to start, we're going to take our ruler, and if I can find my inches here, I'm going to draw out just an inch mark on the, long, on the uh, short end, and that way I can cut down, starting here, a one inch wide strip on the long end of the paper. Then I'm going to do the exact same thing, draw an inch wide this way and cut on the short end. You want these to be about, one about 10 inches in length, the other about five to seven inches in length. The long and short ends of a piece of paper are perfect for that. You just want one longer than the other. Now I've already cut out a couple today. So you can see how they're just like this. And the next part, we're gonna take our tape and I'm using this kind, you can use just regular scotch tape. Um, you probably don't want to use duct tape because that's a lot heavier. I'm going to make two hoops. Once I've got both of these hoops made, we're going to add them to the straw. And we're going to do it, we're going to put one on one end and the other on the other end. Now you can put the straw on the inside of the hoop or the outside, doesn't really matter. But you do want to make sure that the hoops are in line with each other. so that when you're done, it should look like this. Now, let's test it out and see how well I did. How about that? What we are demonstrating here is lift. All kinds of things that fly in an atmosphere use lift to fly. The way we fly, the way our wings work, there's a lot of different kinds of wings. There's airplane wings, there's bird wings, there's insect wings. They all do different things, but they all take advantage of lift to fly. And we're gonna talk about airplane wings for this. So an airplane wing, roughly, is shaped kind of like this. And what is happening is that the pressure underneath the wing is greater than the pressure above the wing. And that means that it pushes up on that wing and generates lift as it flies. Now, there's a lot of different ways that we take advantage of that lift. And we've made the hoop gliders in order to fly that way. What you guys can do at home now is we made ours in a certain way. I want you to try something different. You could use one thick strip of paper and one thin strip of paper. You could try three hoops. You could try and put a hoop underneath and a hoop on top. Maybe it'll work, maybe it won't. Experiment, see how you can do it. Because I can get just the hoop to fly. Ah, there it is because I can take advantage of lift that way. Thank you guys for joining us today. I hope you enjoyed this experiment. Hope it was fun and you learned something. Please be sure and come see us for Mission Aerospace, our exhibition that's opening on May 25th. And as always, please come and see us every week right here for more Wonder Zone fun.